Well, this is being investigated first as a homicide in addition to a hit and run. We're told that the victim, he was shot first and then run over by not one car, but two cars and the driver of the first vehicle fled the scene here, hence the hit and run situation. Now take a look behind us. This is the scene still very active this morning. The incident happened at 1.30 this morning and this is the corner of Vernon and Avalon here in South LA. Now the corner came out earlier this morning, but once the man was flipped over, they realized that this was not a simple hit and run. The man had actually been shot, at least one gunshot wound to his upper body. Now, at this point, Thomas, at that point, rather, homicide was called here to the scene. Detectives believe he was shot here. While he was in the street, someone ran over the man. The driver did not stop. According to a witness, it might have been a black pickup truck. After that, a second car ran over the victim. The driver of the second vehicle stopped and called 911. It's not clear what ultimately caused the man's death. According to police, there was also a pellet gun that was found near or on the victim. And back out here live just to show you the scene because now this involves some sort of special circumstance. Detectives, they're spending extra time out here to gather evidence. We also have an update regarding the victim. We initially said that he was a Hispanic man in his 40s, but now it's believed that he was younger, possibly 25 years old. He has not yet been identified, but police do believe he might have been a transient. If you have any information, you're asked to contact the LAPD. I'm Lena Bergen reporting live in South LA. We'll send it back to you.